hello guys good morning good afternoon good evening depends on location where you're watching me from guys oh my god i would like you to watch this video this video is staring like it's not it's, it's heartbreaking this, this video is heartbreaking out. guys you want to drive out your little baby you love so much was already beside the tire and you are not away and you drive and kill that baby my name is Vincent Obiago okay last month I came here for business trip yes I was opportune to sleep somewhere here which I don't know the location but I, I just knew that it's this place around this area that very day I sat at balcony on top of the building because it's one of my friends he just said I saw I that I, I should follow him down to his house, that he just entered his new house. When I got to the place in the, in the evening, I just came out from the balcony to just have a fresh air. So the man just came to me and said, do I know this roof, this roofing, this red roofing, do I know it? I said, I don't know the place. He said, this place is a Zion, Zion ministry. I cannot locate the place again, but it's around, around this place. I say this person is not a church. It's not a church person. I don't know the reason that spirit directed this man from his room. He woke me. He knocked at my door. Came out to see direct me that this is this is Zion Ministry. That very day, I wanted to reverse my car, and I just feel that there's wedge in the back of my tire. That something is wedging my reverse. So before I know it, one of my daughter came out from inside the house and started shouting that daddy, daddy, see my son under the tire. I just opened the door, rushed outside. When I rushed outside, behold, I saw my son a year and two months. I saw him under my tire. When I shouted, my wife now ran also from the inside the house before I could know it, all my compound is filled up with people. I carry my child. I thought maybe it's, it's, it's hostile issue. But before I know it, people collected the child from me. Some, I just hearing that the boy has died. I, I just try to enter one bush in front of my house. Maybe if I go there, I will kill myself or something like that. Before people just try to call me back, that I should come. They just sat me down. It's, just, it's a terrible issue. So, I thank God for the man of God that prophesied on the third day of 100 days of fasting that there is man. There is a man you kill your own child. There is a man you kill your own child. You kill your own child without knowing it. Every accusation now is towards you. I mean, you want to drive out this person you want to drive out you want to drive out your little baby you love so much was already beside the tire and you are not away and you drive and kill that baby wherever you are i want to see you because danger is coming again everything is satanically manipulated everything is demonically manipulated you don't even know what happens since that time since that time you have not gotten yourself some people says you have used your child you have used your child but indeed your hand is clean you crush your own child i don't know whom 
you are and where you are but you need to come because the same arrow that manipulated you they want to end you mariba kendoroboshinda you kill your own child without knowing it and riba kendoroboshinda your life has not been the same anytime you remember that incident it's as if the ground should open for you to jump in wherever you are you have to come if you don't come people will not cry on your behalf you kill your own child without knowing it a motor accident you want to drive and hit your child you want to drive out and hit your child wherever you are come down in this hundred days the person the remote yes, in your so family this is right now everything about you is crashing down there is somebody remoting your family but wow. that person will go down like in this season in this season of fasting that person will go down Amen. that arrangement the whole thing they are doing all these sacrifices will scatter Amen. in the holy ghost 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 for more updates thank you watch and be blessed i think this prophecy was recently huh? when there is prophecy you must come you must come you don't fail open heaven here I'm now, I have 50,000 Facebook, 40, 39, YouTube. Who knows what we say? Take the link to everybody. This is a mission of God to save millions of the world. This prophecy with solution is a special gift for this end time. Because if you lie, you die like your son. Do I know you? No, no, I never, I never come to this time. He said you came for the first time when he saw that uh, I came for a business trip. Now one of my customer, one of my friend, he just parked into his new apartment beside this. Place. I don't know the place. The man now pointed at this building. That chair, I know the place. I don't. I said I don't know the place. He says this is Zion Ministry, and this the man is not church person. He don't go to church. So, did you come inside or? I, I caught my wife that very night. That they said, the place that I am, that is near the Zion ministry. My wife said, can't I enter there? Because we know our condition, we know our situation. But, you know, Lagos, maybe if I come down from that place, I, I cannot locate the place again. That is Lagos. Now, how did you now watch the open heaven? Who, who told you? How did you now get the message open heaven? Okay. That very day. Because... That very day, there's a one, one man, my neighbor in shop. So he now come to my shop. I just see the man, the man just stand beside my shop. So after now, he just meet my wife. I just hear, hear message, prophecy, prophecy. He's, he's telling my wife. So at the night, I'm in the, my sitting room. So my wife just said, I just had my wife cry inside the, the room. I just rushed inside the room. What is that? Have you started crying again? My wife said, that I should come and see that they locate our case. That I should come and see. Okay, it's even your wife that saw it that day. Yes, no, my wife now showed me. Go and call that man that live around. Before I pray for you. Go and call the man you came for business trip. They say that live around. If you don't bring the man, I won't pray for you. Eh? Please, please, I don't. Hey, go and look for him and bring it. If you don't bring the man, I won't pray for you. Eh? He's not a short person. Uh, go and beg him because of you. Because this message came. I don't know you. Tell him to come. I want to see him. Eh? Christian, allow him to go and look for the man. Bye bye. If you don't come, you will die like your son. That is why the message came. God bless you. Eh? Today. I try to bring him today. Uh, before the program ends. Go. Follow here. Give somebody a high ten. 